Hey guys, it's Scotty here and welcome to my channel. I am here to introduce a new vendor that I found called the Paper Crown Candles. Um, I actually found them through my friend in Minnesota. Um, not that they're from Minnesota, but this was one of the companies that my wax addict friend introduced me to while I was there. And before I even get started, I'm not gonna go through a full snip of everything because I know what they are and I know how they perform because I've already tried each and every one of them while I was away. I just wanted to show you a few things. So first, everything was packaged so nicely. This is ripped up now, but they were all gift wrapped in this cool tissue paper and in this purple paper, shredded paper. Um, all of the um, packages, like maybe four were um, packaged together, wrapped. Everything had a sticker with the best smelling happy mail. Um, this one says, your support means so much, etc. There's also a sticker that thanks you and asks you to give a review of their wax on Facebook or Instagram. It came with this thank you card. Again, note giving their information, their website, where they could found on Instagram and Facebook. Um, they also have a rewards program that you could be part of. They threw in a sample with the scent notes. This one's Winter Court, which is Mountain Balsam, Cedar Bark, and Snow White Cranberries. And the quality checklist, making sure everything on your order is in the box. So we'll go through some of these scents. We have Darkling, which is Wild Blackberry and Dark Musk. We have Puppy Love, look at that label. Juicy Peaches, Apricots, and Orange Fizzy Pop. We have The Grim, Sandalwood, Earl Grey Tea, and Dried Herbs. We have Castle Library, this was one of my favorites. Coconut Wood, Clove, Blood Orange, Black Amber Bean, and Amber. We have Eternal Autumn, which is Vermont Maple, Honey, Apple, and Cinnamon Sugar Donuts. We have A Walk in the Park, which is Fallen Oak Leaves, Citrus, and Golden Amber. We have May Queen, Sugar Jasmine, Fragrant Rose, Orchid, Freesia, and Patchouli. We have Spring Court, Sunlit Peonies, Fragrant Rose, Blossoms and Jasmine, Autumn Court, Fallen Leaves, Crisp Air, Hints of Birch, Dark Arts, Dark Mulberries, Blackberries, and Smoked Vanilla. We have Evil Queen, Mold Blackberries, Cider, and Tart Green Apples. We have Kiss of Death, Blueberry Pumpkin, and Smoked Vanilla. We have Merlin's Beard, Earl Grey Tea, and Lavender Marshmallow Cupcakes, Witching Hour, Apple Cider, Pumpkin Vanilla Waffles, Toasted Marshmallow, and Salted Caramel. We have Witchling, which is Bergamot, Black Cedar, and Vanilla Musk, and Night Court, which is Night Blooming Jasmine, Citrus, and Black Sea Air. I love the creativity of all the labels. It's not just one flat label, and they're just putting it on there with the name. Everything is different. I love that about it too. This company just gave me a good feeling and that's why I decided to melt it while I was there and the performance was really good, lasted a long time. I had to do multiples in a day and put them in different rooms of her home, but I got honestly better success in um, like scentsy warmers, like hot plate or the bulb warmers than I did in tea light. Tea light will of course draw the strength of the oils out, but it doesn't last as long. But I found using it in like Scentsy warmers and which were bulb and element warmers, those lasted the longest. So I just wanted to share this vendor with you. I think they're great. I'm going to continue with them and I am glad I found them. Thank you everyone at the Paper Crown. Thanks for listening guys. And what I will do is below my video, I will add the contact information for the Paper Crown if you're interested. And I hope you enjoyed the review. Have a good night.